Hello everybody, my name is Dude, and welcome to Arietta of Spirits. This is just a demo. It's coming out in 2020, but the demo contains the first act. So we're playing it, and I don't know how long I- I don't know if- uh, what am I trying to say? Normally, if I play a demo of something, it's just the full length of the demo, but I think this is gonna be one I split up into parts. Because I don't got a lot of time to record an entire demo. CAR! Yay! Are we dry- are we moving? How long still? We're almost there, sweetie. Almost there. I- there you go. Half an hour or so. We could drive straight to the shore and take the boat from there. It's not like this is your first time here. When's the last time we were here? Right. We don't seem happy about going wherever we're going. I can't believe it's been a year already. Yeah. Feels weird for me, too. It's gonna be the first time there without her. Who? I'm sure the cabin needs a bit fixing up. Wouldn't want Grandma's place to deteriorate. I guess so. Oh, are we, did we lose our Grandma? Cheer up, Mom. Now look who's talking. Weren't you just moping around a minute ago? Who remembers it? Hey, do you think the water's cold? I mean, I could find out. I think it should be fine. Or should I be doing a Jeff Foxworthy impression? You know what? I'm sure everything will be just like before. That's not Jeff Foxworthy. I don't know remember I don't know how he talks. Just southern twang or is like whatever. Whoa. Arietta of spirits. Are we gonna find our dead grandmother? Or whoever it, we're not with in this adventure. The logo showed like a weird bunny thing. No, that was a ferret. A weird ferret thing. So there's that. Alright, we've... Oh, hello. I can roll. I can roll. Long trip, huh? You must really not enjoyed the car ride if you're out here rolling around in the dirt. Yeah, I'm beat. Well, you did just spend about a couple minutes rolling around in the dirt. We got some work ahead of us. Too bad it's my summer vacation, so I better just take it easy, right? Very funny. Your mother was looking for you. Said she needed help with something. She should be in the cabin. Oh. I'd better go and ask what's up. I think I'm gonna start with some yard work. The garden looks like a jungle. Is that a problem? It is a jungle. Grandma would hate seeing it like this. And it seems like there's no going to the forest side spring at the moment. Where's the forest side spring? That's it. A tree's fallen on the pathway, so go over it. I think I'm gonna start by clearing it out. Gee whiz. It'll probably take me all day. Why do we... why can't we just step over it? Hang in there, Dad. I'm gonna do some helping. I'm blocking part of the UI. Hang on a sec. Okay, there we go. B. Uh... B. Oh, it's the master bedroom. Where's the bathroom? This is one of those places with an outhouse. Hi, Mom. Oh, hi, honey. You needed my help with something? Yeah, I do. I just started cooking his dinner. And I was thinking I'd make us some apple crumble as a dessert. But we didn't bring any apples with us. Could you be a sweetie and go pick up some? The trees are quite far, so... But if you follow the trail through the west of the cab... Boo. I know, I know. I love the sour apples from the big tree. Yeah, Grandma liked those too. Hey, I'll go and get them right away. No sads in this field trip, yo. What was my roll button again? There it is. Oh, are we sweating? Is that why we're rolling around? Ariana, wait up! What? I'm going to pick apples. Where are you heading? Where are you rolling off to? 
Mom asked me to pick, get some apples for us. She's gonna make an apple crumble. Nice. I love that stuff. Oh. If you're heading there, you might want to keep your eye out for wasps. They are especially nasty this time of year, and the island is full of them. You should take this with you. A sword? A wooden... What? What? Dad, I'll be 13 soon. Don't you think it's a little too old to play around with this? Maybe, but I don't want you getting stung. So if those pesky buzzers come after you, just give them a smack with it. It may not be sharp, but it is solid wood. Though it should pack a punch. Alright. Thanks, Dad. Ah, uh, remember when you used to run around as a kid, always swinging that sword around? Drove your mother crazy. Good times, eh? Yeah, yeah. I'll be right back with the apples. Okay. Have fun rolling around. At the speed of sound. Hello, squirrel. Ooh. 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 I'm getting Zelda vibes. Hello, squirrel. I'm going- I'm not going to harm your way of life. Ah. Die, bitch! Oh yeah, I'm definitely getting Zelda vibes and I love it. Do I get anything from fighting those? Do I get rupees? Am I eventually gonna get rupees? Probably not, because finding money in there is a bit weird. Eh. Eh. This just looks silky smooth. Whoa. Hello. Uh. No. I was afraid my I would have been hit in a I would have been hit a long time ago. So far, not so much. Ow. Eh. So far, I'm good. This seems pretty chill. In the way of, uh, how hitboxes work. Hello, butterflies. Come on over here. Goodbye, wasp. No one loves you. Except maybe people who respect wasps as, as not assholes. Not saying wasps deserve to die, but they are little shits, aren't they? That's all I'm saying on the matter. It they actually do have a purpose in the wild, though, so don't kill them. See if we can relocate them safely, but I think they'd be very pissed at you if you did that anyway. There's gotta be a way to relocate wasps safely. I just don't know it. Heh. 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 So far, I've taken no damage. Is this gonna be a no damage run? I think so. So far I'm not challenged yet. Ooh, two of them at once? Alright, can do. I can handle- oh, fuck, there we go. Never mind, I failed my run. Never mind, no one saw that. No one saw it. I didn't lose health, you lost health. I keep thinking the butterflies are some kind of crystal. Big tree. Did we find it? Big tree! Yay. What if we get a mix of them, so it's some of them sour, some of them not? The big tree in the middle has always given the best apples. How am I gonna reach them when they are so high up? Climb! You climb, that's how. Maybe with enough force I could make some of them fall? Ow. Yeah, that did it! Yay. Ow. Is that all I can get? Uh, oh no! Oh crap. Uh, sorry, I didn't know you guys had a hive in there. I say to perform a roll. Rolling is useful when trying to dodge incoming attacks from enemies. No shit! Okay, come on. Come on. Come at me, bitch. Done. Another one? Two more. 
Two more hits and you're gooch. Oh shit. One more hit and we gooch. Done. Done. Easy peasy. And now all the wasps are probably dead because that was the queen. And uh yeah. I better get back to the cabin. Yeah, you better. That that's a that's a good plan. That's a very good plan. Also, that probably did just solve a lot of the wasp problem, because you killed the queen. And, um... I don't know about you, but something tells me that's gonna be a bad time. Apples done! Got the apples! Thanks, hon. Oh, you got plenty! This'll only take a minute. Go and tell your dad the dinner's ready. Yes, ma'am! Where is he? Where is father figure? Give me just a second. Done. Damn, that took a long time. I need a shower. In a bathroom that we don't have. Hey, you're back. Those wasps give you a hard time? Nah. I had it. Dinner's almost done. Yeah? Let's go and set the table. After I shower, and again, in the bathroom that we don't own in this house. Why did, I, why did your grandmother not invest in a bathroom? A washroom would be lovely. Seriously, just saying. Like, how do you not have a washroom? Hey. <sighs> Everything okay, dear? Yes, it's just... You miss her, huh? Been to this island every summer of my life, yet this is the first time here without her. An empty chair is almost more than I can bear. This all just brings back so many memories. Yeah, we had good times here, right? I swear I can still feel her here. And yeah, when I turn around to see, she's not there. And yeah, we had good times, right? Now you can make new memories, but... Okay, yeah, that's probably gonna be very hard. Considering you're still thinking... You're still mourning. Come on. I miss her so much. We all miss her. I expected that this visit... Br Brings up some emotions. But I'm sure your mother's smiling down on us and is really glad that we've kept up on this tradition. I guess so. Thank you. Now don't you worry, none. It'll get better. And it will. It just takes time. It's been a long day with the traveling and all. Maybe we should get some sleep. Everything will look different tomorrow. Yeah. And we cleared out a path in the woods so we can go to the east. Assuming up is north and down is south and all that. Could be... it. It's likely the case because west was left. Left. West was this way. So, yeah. Well, now what do we got? Now what do we got? What do we got? Arietta. Arietta. Wake the fuck up, Arietta! Oh. Ooh. Oh. I've got go. I've got sword. I've still got sword. Okay. These are ghosts. Whoa. What happened? Uh... Are they gonna hurt me? Oh god. Okay, they hurt. They hurt like fuck. They hurt like fuck. And I'm gonna die. Okay, maybe I'm supposed to die. Maybe this is a cutscene. Please. 
Wow. Um, whoa. Whoa. First of all, what was that? Arietta. Um, yes, that is our name. What, what's, what's up? How can Arietta help you, disembodied voice? Wake up. Wow. Okay, that happened. Finally. Who's talking? Here. Where's here? That's not... Eh? Huh? Um... The, 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 the ghost! Shit, not so loud! You don't want to wake your parents. I can assure you I am not a ghost. Although I understand my looks may hint otherwise. Yeah, you, I must be dreaming still. I'm afraid you're wide awake. Unfortunately, the situation has dictated that I reveal myself ahead of time. What does that mean? What do you mean? Arietta, I have known you for a long time. Although you haven't seen me before, I've been hiding in the shadows through most of your life. I've waited many years for this moment. Well, that's disturbing! Listen carefully. I have something important to tell you. What is it? My name is Arco. I come from a realm that exists in parallel to the world that you know. It is called the Spirit Realm. Up until now, it has been completely invisible to you, as it is to any other. For eons, my kind have served the humans as guides, working together, helping those who have perished and gotten lost, becoming spirits. Trapped echoes of existence, unable to find their way forward. I have given you the ability to perceive the spirit realm around you by binding my ma my energy with yours. You are now what mine calls a bound. What my guy, what my kind calls a bound, a human that is bound to their spirit guide, which I am to you. Realms and spirits. So you mean like ghosts? If you want to put it that way, sure. It's good enough. The spirit realm is like a veil, resting on top of the human world. When a human dies, you cannot move on to the afterlife. They get caught in that veil. Oh, when a human dies but cannot move on to the afterlife, they get caught in that veil. Their energy gets trapped and thus becomes a spirit. There is always a reason to why one ends up this way. An unresolved matter from when they were alive, or the inability to realize one's unfortunate fate. Our job is to help these spirits to move on. Okay. Okay, let's say I believe you, but why do you need me? Why not just help these spirits or whatever by yourself? My kind only ever exists as ethereal beings, formed out of pure energy. We do not possess a physical body, not even in the spirit realm. Therefore, it's impossible for us to make any true difference to the surrounding world. You, however, as a bound, now have the means to interact between both realms. I am still blocking something. Shit. Hang on. Okay, that's better. The human world and the spirit realm. Our job is to seek out and guide people like you, who we deem fit for the task. And you have displayed a great deal of courage and righteousness, traits that we value throughout your life, especially f so for someone as young as yourself. Okay. Yet it is very uncommon that we grant this ability to anyone until they've come of age. But something has come up. And what's that? Arietta, there is someone who's in a dire need of your help. Is it the gra is it my grandmother? Does she need help passing on? Who is it? She's waiting for you on the pier. Okay. Uh, where's my save button? Oh! Grandma? Arietta, darling. Grandma? But how? Y you... There was a... You're... Dead? I'm quite aware of it, dear. You don't have to remind me. I kind of... 
I kind of know I'm dead. It's a thing you feel, you know? Like a leg being numb. Now don't be too sad for me. It was just my time to go. Death is an inevitable part in Death is an inevitable part of life, and it's I've already already made my peace with it years back. Living as uh, living as old as I have, and you start to reflect on things. Live as old as I have, and you start to reflect on things. I think this needs a bit of retranslation. Because of your new friend that we got to meet once again. That's a very strange looking thing. It's Arco. A-R-C-O. And who are you calling strange looking? Mrs. Butthead? Yeah, I see your head. And your hairstyle. Grandma, why are you here? Shouldn't you be, you know, doing dead things? I haven't been able to move on just yet. Why? What's wrong? You see, I have a promise to keep. For your mother. And what's that? Over a decade ago, I promised to, to leave her our old family ring, just like my mother once gave it to me. Your silver ring? That's right. The silver is from the very same mine that's located in this island. It has been in the, in the family for ages. During my last days here, it was lost and I didn't have the chance to come back for it. Until now. I searched high and low and finally managed to find it. It was lying on the ground at the forest side spring. No idea how it got all the way up there. Yet as soon as I reached my hand out in the attempt to pick it up, these terrible beings came out of nowhere and surrounded me. I was so frightened that I ran back here and I left the ring right where I had found it. And it was then I met Arco. Those awful monsters must have been after the ring too. Why? I might have an idea of what those so-called monsters actually were. It's uncommon that they would react like that to a ring, though, or any object for that matter. I am telling you, they came straight for it. But thank heavens for that, since I managed to slip past while they were distracted. Maybe we should go and see if it's still there. If what you think is true, I'm interested in seeing this ring myself. Could be anything, huh? So for a whole year, you've been here? A year? What are you talking about? I've only been here for a little while, I think. Ugh. Time might move in different directions. Don't worry, Grandma. We'll get that ring back. That we will! I don't want to get you in any trouble over me. Too bad. It's happening. And I have Arco here to protect me. We'll be back before you know it. Which will hopefully be two seconds in your time perception, because apparently a year went by and you didn't notice that you'd been gone for so long. Please, just be careful. On it! Where's my save button? I guess I gotta find a checkpoint. And then it saves. That's hopefully the autosave feature in the lower corner. So I'm going to stop the episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe for more. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Thank you to Shrum. Love you all for supporting me on Patreon. And also Brian as well for that. And thank you to these fine people for supporting me on Twitch. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye! Uh.